What's it saying? Right, we're now walking back through the wood, I think. I knew there was, on the way, I came down the, the road, which I knew I hadn't done last year. I knew there was a way through the wood, because it took a while. So I'm going, I can't remember how steep this is. I got the video playing. I've just come back from Portia's said Keys. I had to have a Coke and an ice cream. I didn't plan on this, so I'm gonna turn it off a minute. Right, I've just climbed up some steps. I had to turn off. They were quite steep and they went on for quite a while. Now on the way to the Porter said Keys, I knew I'd um, gone through a longer bit of wood. There's a nice, there's a bench up. Just come from that way. There's a nice view from here. You can see just as much from this viewpoint as you can down there, where there's a bigger viewpoint. That'll probably take you down. I think I'll stay at the top. I got a feeling I came along the back. Yeah, I did. I probably videoed it. We're talking at least. I'm just trying to imagine when it was. See, look, look at this porter said. Very windy now, storms come in later. I thought I'd make a day of this, to be quite honest. I thought I'd make a day of it. It's been very warm, but some got some beautiful shots with a different camera, of course. I mean, if that was four or five years ago, that would have been a mobile camera which was quite good actually, that mobile camera. It might have been nearly as good as this, but it didn't have a zoom, a huge zoom on it. But it did do good images, that one. And then of course I went over to the Vivitar ones, which were very, very basic indeed. But still a record in time. And it was all we were, could afford at the time, with the rechargeable batteries. I always used to run out of film in them days. This energising thing is good. I always seem to get round to using it. I always think to myself, oh, don't do too many videos, Sheila. You've got loads to do. And I've done all the church again, which has changed, by the way. It's had lots of refurbishments. Um, different banners and artwork in it. And I was able to video it and finish just before the nursery lady came in. We was expecting to do an indoor picnic with the tots because it was too hot for them to go out in the gardens. Yeah, well, this is like a circular. I've gone down one side of Porter Said Keys. Got a bought a Coke, had a cup of ice cream with a flake just to keep cool. I've been wearing my hat, I haven't got it on now. The wind keeps blowing it off. The wind's quite fierce in here and there. And it is shadier here. I then came back up the other side of the Keys to get another perspective. Rather than go back into town on the roads, I thought, oh no, and traffic and, and exhaust on a hot day. I thought, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not rushing either, but I would like to be able to get the six o'clock. So it takes nearly an hour and 20 minutes to get back to Weston. I reckon the five o'clock one would be really packed. There is one at seven o'clock-ish. I 
I said to be back for half five, but actually it's more like five to six. The next, I can't remember exactly to be quite honest, but it's near six o'clock. But anyway, this is beautiful. It is absolutely baking. It's got to be 30, 35 degrees today. The wind is only slightly cooling you. You literally have to get in the shade. Like I said, I did the, the B road down the bottom there, which was quite nice because I hadn't done it before. Once again, a different perspective. Chris Porter said it's got a massive history with its power station, its um, harbours and docks. It was very busy. It was a mariner town. I hate it when you get a split in the... Um, because I'm not that. I don't want to end up down one side if I ought to go that side so I'm mainly going to keep to the side because that's going down on the wrong side of the hill for me look so we stay here years of walking and map reading and stuff always does help and your instinct of course yeah right down through deep into down this ancient wood we, this is an ancient wood by the way Apparently, it's ancient, this wood. Um, there is a, a road, but you can't see it. It's a long way down. I know that. I've just climbed up. So this is Sheila. 18th. Is it the 18th? i got a feeling it's either the 18th or the 19th. I don't know. It could actually. I might have been saying the 18th. Um, but I've got a feeling it's the 19th today. I'll put it right when I do the videos. I'll put it on the... Um, I'm just trying to think of the date. Yeah, I reckon yesterday I was saying the 19th, 18th. Today's the 19th, so I've been saying the 18th. That's from yesterday's videos. I'm just going to show you how my face... It'll be bright red full of sweat <sighs> really hot it's nice though. it's better than being cold isn't it <sighs> just had a small sit down on there I, got, I can always buy some more water I'm going to buy another drink of some sort when I get back into town I've got enough water to get me back into town, but I'll need something to drink on the bus. If we're going to be on that bus for an hour and a half... I mean, it's hot when you get out of places like this. Like, if you go... when you go back into town near the roads, it is baking hot. There's no shade. Well, according to this, I've got one hour. But I've got to allow, I've said I'd get back by half five or quarter to six. <sighs> Nearly an hour. This isn't too bad. It won't take long to get back into the town. <sighs> I nearly lost my camera again earlier. Where I'd stopped and had a drink. I put my camera down on a bench. Fortunately, fortunately, after about five minutes, it had been left five even 10 minutes on this bench. I went to reach for it to take a picture of the lake and I couldn't find it. So I had to more or less bomb back to that bench and I just I was approaching and a young man was he seen me though and I said, oh my camera, but he was, he'd spotted it. He, he crossed over the road to get it. He probably would have, the thing is it would have been they would have just swapped the memory card, you know. But they could have got into my computer, couldn't we? Couldn't they? If you think my all your gadgets are wired up to your computer now. 
<coughs> I would have notified Sony that it was stolen, but of course I haven't got it covered. It's only 140 quid. It's a lot of money though. Um, most people just leave it behind, wouldn't you? That's what I probably would have done, but I would have ruined the walk. Because I didn't bring a spare camera. I don't need to bring a spare camera now I've got the battery, see? Now I've got the energizer. So this is Sheila's ramblings. It's not it's just me rambling, it's a visual diary. It's for the descendants. What's going on in the world? Well, there's been more police killings in America. There's been lots of... I think they said 6,000 people have been detained in Turkey who are seen as tre you know, people who do treason. <sighs> I do worry about a friend of mine out there, but uh, she's got a business. I don't expect she'll be affected by it. I don't know. They want to get into the EU anyway. The coup didn't pull, you know, they tried, someone tried doing a coup and there were tanks on the road and everything. Here's this lane, I think, now. Is this the lane I came up earlier? No, it might have been. Oh, we just go down this way. I reckon this leads us back. I can hear people in the swimming pool. So it's been a good day. It's only repeating what I've done several years ago but with a different camera. Yeah, people were queuing to get in that pool. Right, see you later.